Break. I hope it's all right if we do this up here. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Good, because I've been dying for a cigarette all day. Do you have any trouble parking? No, I actually walked. Get away from Dorchester? Yeah, but I, I can assure you, you're not going to have any issues with my attendance. Let me give you the rundown. We work five, maybe six days out of the week. You'll have goals and objectives that your supervisors will expect you to meet on time. If you slack off, grow complacent, get lazy, it'll show in your productivity. Is that understood? Yes, and I promise you I'm committed to being the, the best I can be here. Shereen, let me give you some advice. Your supervisors aren't gonna give a fuck about you because they don't give a fuck about you. Keep your head down. Do your part. So does that mean I got the job? Fill this out. You're all set? Be here tomorrow by 2 p.m. for orientation. Of course. Thank you. Congratulations. Mr. Thomas, you forgot something. Do you have a criminal record? Uh, no. What's up, big head? Yeah. What's going on? Hey, How was she today? Good. Sheen, Frankie were driving me pictures all day. You're more upbeat than usual. Wait, you got the job? Yeah. Congrats! Yeah, uh, I gotta go back to orientation tomorrow at like 2, but it finally happened. You should be proud of yourself. I know I am. I actually had an uncle who grew up in Dorchester. Shame what happened to that place. Mr. Thomas, do you know why you're here? Is this because of my record? Why did you choose to lie on the application? I hoped it didn't matter. Didn't matter? Yes. Why wouldn't this matter? Because I can do the work. I'm qualified to do the work. I still haven't heard any excuses for lying. I went to prison for selling marijuana. The only irony is the state barely recognizes that as a crime anymore. And you believe this makes you innocent? I believe I've been a law-abiding citizen since my release. I just need a second chance. I 
I just want to take care of my daughter. All I want to do is be a dad. I read once that America is the land of the second chance. And when the gates of the prison open, the path ahead should lead to a better life. Who said that? George W. Bush. Believe it or not, I'm actually a Democrat. Mr. Thomas, I wish I could give you good news, but my hands are tied. Oh shit, what up, Jay? When they let you out? Bob, about a year now. Word up, I'm glad you're home. Yeah, look, I called because uh, I need some work. I, I got my daughter now. Can you be making some money? Hey man, say less. I actually got a new connect from Provi now. Great A shit. Now the thing is, the nigga, I get the way from a little paranoid about me bringing it. But I gotta pick up from him tomorrow. If you're serious, you can roll with me and let dude size you up. Yo, Jay. Uh, yeah, 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 that's cool. I'll be there. Just on the way to meet you. Alright, I'm leaving out at about two. Alright, I got you. Word, but yo, we not moving trees no more. Next level. These streets missed you. Time to get this money. What the fuck, man? What's up? What's up? You just broke into my crib. Nigga, I didn't break into your crib. See what's wrong with your door? Yo, you should really get that fixed before somebody really breaks in. Whatever. What are you doing here? It's after 11. My girl kicked me out. I need a place to crash. You can't be serious. All right, look, you can take the couch, but you gotta be quiet. Maya's asleep. Here, you breathe, I, I, you gotta bounce. I got gotcha. you, I got gotcha. you. I got an interview at noon, so make sure you're up and out early. Damn, another one? Why is you wanna get that shit up here, bro? Daddy? Basically, what you're gonna do is you're gonna pull that now. Okay. 
Hey, your door is open, so. Hey, yeah, uh, don't, don't even worry about that. Um, look, I can't pay you to watch my. Hey, dad, but I... it's okay. I like watching her. <sighs> Thank you so much. Listen, Jay. I just want you to know that if you ever need anything, I'm here. Anything. Thank you. Maya, Rochelle's here. All right, I got your bag. I got your sneakers right here. What's this? I made it for you. You made it for me? Mm-hmm. Is that me? Yeah. Who's that? Mommy. Oh, uh, thank you. Hi, right, good night. Good hug? Oh. All right, well, I'm gonna make sure to hang this up. Till then, you're gonna hang out with Rochelle. Here's her bag. You just need this. All right? Okay. Make sure to be good for Rochelle, all right? No, no, no. Please leave your message. Change of plans. We gotta meet the connected noon. It's now or never, Jay. Damn, another one? I'm surprised you're still doing this. Supervisors aren't gonna give a fuck about you. Because they don't give a fuck about you. Mr. Thomas, I wish I could give you good news, but... My hands are tied. 